Hi, I'm Don Harold. How are you? Today's Thursday, September 25th, 2008. This week I've received an awful lot of email from people who want to know my opinion about this bailout. And gee whiz, it's the largest bailout in the history of America. Barry Ritholtz tonight on Fast Money said it was the largest bailout in the history of the planet. He's right about that. Maybe in the history of the, uh, the universe. I don't know if they have bailouts in other galaxies. Look, keep in mind what, exactly what we're doing here. This is going to be the biggest bailout, not in American history, in the history of planet Earth. Is it asking too much for the Congress to say, let's not go home, let's take a week, let's do this intelligently, let's think about this, let's not just ram through some half-assed, last-minute thing, let's get this right the first time, instead of having to come back six months later and saying, gee, we messed this up, we messed that up, yeah. let's see if we can actually do something positive and intelligent instead of harried in last minute and on the cheap. Well, but you might expect that I'd have something to say. The truth of the matter is, uh, I said what I was going to say about the bailout last year. I said what I was going to say about this bailout two years ago. I said all I had to say about this bailout before the word bailout was even used. You see, my opinion was that if the Federal Reserve began to cut interest rates last year, the market would drop through the floor, which it did. This was while the mainstream media was pumping Goldilocks and the economic nirvana. My opinion was that if the dollar continued to get hammered, inflation would go through the roof, and it did. This, of course, was while the Larry Cuddles of the world told you that inflation wasn't a problem. Jim Cramer told you last year, for example, there wouldn't be any inflation in 2008. Oh, all the stories we were told. But my opinion about the bailout was last year. My opinion about the bailout was, well, last month. My opinion about bailouts is always going to be, in a free market, we don't want to be bailing people out. And what you need to do in this new world of bailouts is find ways to make money in this environment. Uh, Jim Cramer and I actually agree on that. Uh, I don't agree that the bailout is necessarily the positive that Jim does. But I do believe that the time for blaming, name-calling, and second-guessing is over. The time for you to figure out how to live in this economic environment is right now. Now, I'm going to begin a series of videos where I teach you how to make money in the market, how to, how to shore up your family's finances, uh, what you can do to start a home-based business, all sorts of things. And maybe a year or two down the road, there'll be some other crisis, and you might want my opinion about that. And I'm going to turn you back to these videos in the same way I'm turning you to my videos last year and say to you the following. No matter what the environment is, you need to do what's right for your family and your business and your friends and your community and your country today so that if a bailout or crisis comes tomorrow, you're prepared. Until next time, I'm Don Harrell. Bye-bye.